guys, I am here at Hapjong Station. I am waiting for TNT, Thomas and Tracy. We're gonna grab some dinner today. It's Friday, we're gonna hang out, you know, get crazy, get pumped. You know, what do kids lay It's gonna be lit. Uh, no, we're just gonna grab dinner and then I think we're gonna head to one of the spas just to relax for the Friday evening and then we'll see where the rest of the night takes us. But I'm here waiting for them. I'm hungry. I'm so hungry. Oh my god, you guys, it's Thomas and Tracy from the YouTube. Ah! Oh my god, aren't you guys from YouTube? <laughs> Perhaps. <laughs> You guys, look, they got their camera fixed. Korean magic in one hour. How much was it? It was like 170 US. Yeah, that's so cheap. Yeah. Oh my goodness, <laughs> so happy. Yesterday we were bike riding. I don't know if I told you guys. I don't know if I vlogged it, but we were bike riding and for some reason their camera broke in Tracy's purse while we were riding bikes. We won't frame Tracy. I didn't say I'm not saying anything. I didn't say I'm not saying it's Tracy. I didn't say anything. I'm just mentioning her name, but I'm not saying anything about Tracy. Oh, Thomas and Nida. That was really good. That was really good. <laughs> You guys, we're here at the Kimchi Jjigae restaurant. It's called Uri Dongne Kimchi Jjigae. Uh, I don't know if it's famous, but Angel actually came here and she said it was really good, so that's why I brought Thomas and Tracy. I actually invited Angel, but she um, has some issues with her leg. She has stitches, so she can't be out and about. Amazing! Look at that tonkatsu, how crispy it is and flaky. I can't wait to dig into that. It looks so good. We just finished up dinner. It was really good. So great. Thanks Angel for the recommendation. Right now I'm gonna take Tracy to get some cupcakes at Chickalicious. The same place that I've been to before a few times, just a couple of times. Hopefully they have some good flavors left over. And then afterwards I think we're gonna head to the spa and we're gonna meet up with Alex. So it'll be a nice relaxing Friday evening for all of us. Guys, we made it here to Shilo Am Sana. We're gonna enjoy some relaxing spa time, bath time, naked time, whatever you wanna call it. Guys, we just finished up with the spa. It was really good, really relaxing. Alex, how do you feel? I feel super chill. Super chill, just like, just real cool, calm, real and collective. Cool. Not fake cool. Just <laughs> real cool. Real cool. How are you guys? It was nice, right? Great. So Always. It's super relaxing. Yeah. So we're heading back to the station. We're all gonna head back home. And then I guess we'll just see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys. Um, good morning. Today's the next day. I am up kind of early. What time is it? It's 9 o'clock on a Saturday. I am gonna meet up with Tracy Thomas and Alex. We're gonna go get brunch in Hongdae. Well, actually, I'm meeting up with Thomas and Tracy at their Airbnb hostel. I don't know what they're staying in. Anyways, it's in Myeongdong, so we're gonna head there and then just hang out. They're leaving today. Ah, they just got here. What the hell? Oh. <laughs> It's Alex. Hello, sir. You know what? Yesterday, Alex, I don't know if he's gonna 
be upset if I tell you guys this, but I'm gonna tell you guys. Yesterday, um, we were supposed to meet for dinner, and so while at school, I messaged him and told him like, hey, we're meeting here at this time, um, see you soon. And that was like early in the day, like early afternoon, and like the entire day, nothing, no message. Like it didn't even go through. You know how you can like check to see if the message went through or if they checked it? It, it didn't even get to the point where it arrived. It was like his phone was off or he turned off his messenger. So I messaged him on Facebook Messenger, on Kakao. I called him two times and you're like, whoa, Jeff, you're a bit obsessed. No, I was just, after a while, I was kind of concerned. And then Sarah, who was all the way on the other side of the world, messages me and it's like, hey, have you um, talked to Alex? And I said, no, I've tried messaging him and he has not responded. And so that made me uh, get a bit worried, like, hey, what happened to Alex? But he's he's a grown man, so I was like, he's fine. But then a part of me was like, oh no, what if something happened? And I was just like, maybe he just lost his phone or his phone died. Anyways, this punk messaged me back and goes, yo, sorry, I just lost track of time and didn't check my phone. I wanted to punch him. Oh, oh, this is for you, Alex. Oh. Anyways, he ended up having to skip dinner which is not important to this vlog. I am going to get ready and then we're gonna head to Myeongdong. So let's go. <sighs> oh shit, you're naked. <laughs> Sorry guys, I had to turn off the camera real quick. I didn't know Thomas was gonna be naked. He wasn't. <laughs> yeah, I was butt naked. I was butt naked, opening the door. Anyways, good morning guys. Good morning! Oh, good morning! <laughs> you guys check out how small their, their hotel room is. I'm at the door That's by it. the way. This is it. <laughs> but it's right in Myeongdong and it's only 37 Canadian like. Oh, it's so cheap. Is there any other day? Like one that ties up? No. There's only this one that zips up. What's up, dude? <laughs> Sorry! Guys, right now we're at Bistro having brunch and Alex joined us. Alright guys, the food has arrived, we're ready to eat. We would like to thank Alex for waiting for us to get all the b-roll footage and all the stupid pictures. I would like to thank Lord Jesus. Anyways, we're gonna enjoy our meal. As usual, Thomas finishes Tracy's food. How was it guys? Delicious. It's good. Alex? I meant to say it's horrible, but I only eat all of them. Ah, cute! Ah! <laughs> what is it? Oh. You have a small face. I'm gonna step behind it. Oh my god, you're so, you're so Korean, stop. <laughs> Guys, we just finished up brunch. Alex, how was brunch? Filling. Filling. Satisfying. Oh. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow, multiple adjectives. Filling and satisfying. Are those adjectives? Um, I think so. Okay, we're English teachers. <laughs> so check. Uh, we're on our way to a cafe that Tracy found. I think it's called Greenish. 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 Something she wanted to try the strawberry milk that was there, and so we're gonna go get that. Mm. 
I think out of the ones that I've had, the watermelon and the strawberry one, this one's really good. Do you really? want what tissue or what? Yeah, the watermelon probably second and then the strawberry last because it wasn't... Strawberry just like strawberry. But yeah, strawberry it wasn't like anything special. Yeah. And these are like actual big chunks of peaches. So it's really nice. Why are you focusing on me? Oh, okay, there we go. Hey guys, I am double cameraing right now, double fishing cameras. Uh, we are here at Ursulok, the Jeju Green Tea House. And I think we're just gonna take a rest and then maybe head to another area or try to find somewhere to go do some more shopping. I think Thomas wanted to get some more clothes before he headed back to Japan. So I think we're gonna try and do that. I'm really sad that they're leaving today. This is weird. I'm really sad that they're leaving today. I wish we could. I wish we just like live near each other. It would be great. Why do we have to live so far? Why, guys? Why? 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 Answer my question in the comments down below, please. Anyway, so we're waiting for drinks back here and just gonna rest and then head out and play some more. It's that time again. I have to say bye to these guys. I feel like we do this too often. A bit too often. You think we'd be used to it by now, but it's just it's just as hard and it hurts a little bit. So I kind of blame you guys for making me feel this way. Yeah. It's we just got to see it this time, it. and it was so worth it. It seriously. was totally worth it. Yeah. I want to thank you guys for coming. Um, mm. Like seriously, we love Korea so much. And I know that like we love the food, we love the culture, but a big part of the reason why we came was because of Jeff. Mm. <laughs> Seriously, I can't wait to come back and visit him, guys. Or like, him Seriously. come to Canada. I keep convincing yeah. him to just like be Canadian and come not to the dark side, but to the light side. The light side. I it love might, you Americans too, but, <laughs> but come on, Canada's where it's at. Seriously. We don't live in igloos. So. <laughs> and then we can visit more friends of Jeff's. Yeah. So yeah, so nice that Jeff showed us around. Introduce us to nice people. Turned us Korean. Turned us Korean. Yeah, seriously, they look good, so, right? They look yeah, we good. Got, like, thanks to him, we got a mad identity crisis. You got like two Chinese Taiwanese uh, from Canada living in Japan who look Korean. Yeah. Like, how messed up is that? Seriously, I think we we all are on, on the ocean, American living in Korea, speak yeah. Korean, but I look kind of Korean yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways, this is gonna be it, guys. So we'll see you next time. Take care. Bye. Would you like to do the honors? Guys. <laughs> <laughs>